is the altcoin season finally here. Uh, Bitcoin experienced a sharp correction on February 20th, sinking as much as 4% from an intraday high of $53,019 to a low of $50,812, threatening to wipe out the E1 dev 75 days that were managing works and money. Uh, this very simple pullback led traders ultimate NBA bolty and making it a lot of policies about what's starting now, uh, the general condition of the crypto market. Uh, initiating a debate on whether the altcoin season, uh, these are alt season, and if traders and market analysts believe the ongoing price crash is a part of the five phases of the Bitcoin halving cycle, and that BTC might be experiencing a pre-halving retrace before entering a widely expected post-halving parabolic uptrend. And the crypto trader and analyst Rec Capital shared the following chart in a February 15th post on X saying that Bitcoin has one last pre-halving retrace left before resuming uptrend. Independent market analyst Shul noted funding rates were high for BTC warning traders to hey, expect some correction across a board. Market intelligence firm Santiment pointed out significant moves and mid-tier traders often work as excellent signals for profit-taking and dip buys. Uh, uh, this is an indication that they could be getting ready to buy the dip in case of a pullback. Uh, Bitcoin versus all coins. Uh, all coins have displayed great performance over the last 12 months, um, posting double and triple-digit gains with some outperforming Bitcoin. Some of them have um, demonstrated better performance on shorter time frames. Um, according to data from CoinMarketCat, Bitcoin has rallied 107% over the last 12 months. Solana has gained 308%. Avalanche's ABAX 80% and Chainlink's 136%. The latest data from on-chain analytics firm Glassnode shows that while BTC and ETH are leading the pack with year-to-date gains of 17.6% and 18.2% respectively, Bitcoin's year-to-date performance surpasses aggregate altcoin market cap. Uh, Glassnode analyst Alice Cohen said, the aggregate altcoin market cap has not experienced the same performance, with YTD growth being less than half of the two majors. And Glassnode notes that although Ether began to outperform BTC, following the approval of the spot Bitcoin ETFs in January, its performance fell below Bitcoins on February 8th. And according to Glassnode, the performance of digital assets can also be tracked by using realized cap for each sector a metric that aggregates the cost basis value of all the coins transferred on chain. Uh, Glassnode notes that Bitcoin continues to display dominance seeing approximately twenty billion dollars in capital inflows per month at present. As the chart below highlights, Bitcoin's dominance has continued to grow with a thousand percent surge in relative market cap since October 2023. Uh, it is evident that capital moves down the risk curve into all coins at a slower pace compared to the rotation between the two major cryptocurrencies, a trend which appears to be in play once again, notes the report. Bitcoin continues to lead with over 52% market share of the total digital asset market cap. Uh, how close is alt season? On February 18th, independent analyst Stock Money Lizards told his followers on the X social media platform that he believes many altcoins are about to skyrocket in the next alt season. Uh, the analysts shared a chart showing that the altcoin market cap uh, had scaled above a significant uh, support area and entered into a bull run similar to uh, the 10x returns experienced in 2021. Uh, even though some signs are there, it may still be too early to confirm the altcoin season. Glass nodes alt season indicator has shown positive momentum since October last year. He turned positive on February 4th. After taking a pause during the sell the news event triggered by the Bitcoin ETF's approval in January. Uh, interestingly, the indicator has remained positive since then, uh, indication that the market is now in a risk on mode, showing the confidence uh, that the investors have in the altcoins. Uh, in front, data from Blockchain Center shows that only 59% of the top 50 altcoins have outperformed BTC during the last 90 day period. Although this index has been increasing over the last few days, it is still not enough to declare an altcoin season. 
for an alt season to be declared, this percentage has to move above 75%. And Glassnode concludes, our altcoin indicator suggests a more mature and possibly sustained uptick in altcoin markets. However, it remains relatively concentrated in higher market cap assets at this time. This means that signs of an altcoin season is starting to emerge, but it might be too early to make the call. With that said, thanks for watching, and until next time,